New on the Four, Crime Stoppers needs your help in solving a cold case from 2019. Investigators found the remains of Johnny Lee Rhodes in October after he was reported missing a month ago. That's right. Our Bria Chapman sat down with his mother today about why she would like to see justice served for her son's killer, Bria. Yeah, that's right, Jen and Morgan. Kathy Rhodes says she had a great son. She said they talk about 15 times a day, but after he was killed, her life changed forever. And she says living without him is hard, but it's even harder knowing his killer is still out there. I just wish that I could just hold him one more time and tell him mama loves you, son. Mama wants to be with you. Kathy Rhodes says the last four years without her son have been a nightmare. Johnny Rhodes is her youngest child and a father of seven. She says he suffered from seizures most of his life and they would cause him to become disoriented. He's been missing two or three times, but he's always come back. Always. He never failed to come back. I could go get him. I could go right where he was at. It just seemed like that. Something was telling me he's over here. But this time she couldn't help. Rhodes received a call on September 8th, 2019, saying Johnny was missing. Her family began searching for him, and then she got a call five weeks later. She says a dog found Johnny's arm in a wooded area. Then the next day they got out there and they found some more, and then the next day they found some more. They found 70% of Johnny's body. They said he was shot. They said he was beat to death. They took him and dumped him over there, took his clothes off, stole his phone. Rose says losing a child is hard, but to know no one has been brought to justice in her son's murder makes things even harder. Don't see how anybody can live with their self knowing what they done. I mean, how can they lay down on that bed at night and sleep knowing that they done wrong? It's hard living here. It's hard living here. A life knowing that he got his took away from me. I've even asked God, I said, why didn't you take me? The mother's supposed to die first, not the kids. Yeah, really sad story. Crime Stoppers is offering a $2,500 reward for any leads or identification of anyone involved in this murder. And Rhodes says she will continue to fight until her son's killer is in custody. Reporting live, I'm Bria Chapman, WBRC, Fox 6 News on your side.